This Mercedes is now finished, ready for collection, and while well, waiting for collection, client's gonna come back end of this week. We've had this car here, well, it's the second week now. Uh, this one, it came in initially for just a kind of protection, winter protection, and then it's gonna be put away for the storage, but we kind of convinced Nick. Say hi to Nick. Hi, Nick. Hi, Nick. <laughs> I'm not missing the way. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll get it, make, make it pink. We'll wrap a pink for him for, for a new season. So it's gonna have um, full machine polish, ceramic coating, all the windows polish as well. For some reason, they've got really stain, they look really stainy. Um, so I don't know what says that. Our import, so it could be anything on it. So all the door shells needs to be polished and see what we can do with it. It's just like, it's just it's not coming seals. off. New That's seals? seals to go on. Oh yeah, those new seals, they will be taking those ones off. So the steering wheels will be coming off. So we'll take the steering wheel off. We'll see if we can put the paddle shifters in. Um, yeah. So a bit of a work in there. Very interesting project. The first thing we're gonna get polished and we can keep this car as long as you want because he's gonna be putting out into the first storage. So if it's stored here or somewhere else, it doesn't matter. <laughs> It's probably better for him to keep it here, actually. <laughs> but anyway, we'll get, we need to get it done. We've got another detail next week and, and lots of other work. So I'm just gonna crack on with the polishing and then see how we're going with that. Maybe midweek or end of the week, we'll try to do the steering wheel. Depends on the vinyl on this one. We'll start wrapping. This car has got two weeks here as well. Luckily, in the new place, we can have six cars. So we should manage somehow with all the work and storage so let's go so we've got a bit of overspray here which we're gonna try to sand it down and polish it back up so just a bit of a white on the black because this side has been resprayed looks pretty good now putting a jeep back in I can't get focus, 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 focus. Uh, we can't get a vinyl until mid of December, so. <laughs> he did say check the vinyl. Well, we did check the vinyl, but we kind of didn't know how long it's gonna take. But they phoned us and they said mid December, so most likely still waiting for the client confirmation. But it's gonna go back and come back in January once we got the vinyl. So. It will take him probably half an hour to put it back on. He knows how to do it now. What do you mean now? <laughs> well, once you take it apart, you know how to put it back. <laughs> um, this one was for the window tint and dichrome around the windows and the front grille. So 5%, Kenny? Looks dark. Is it? That's 20%. Well, oh, it looks quite dark. Huh? And then we've got a front grille dichrome as well. So we've got some sanding marks here. Oh, yes, there we are. You can just see it now. So we'll get a wee rupus and we'll get the polished. So we've got more overspray on a grill, probably when a bumper was sprayed. So we'll get that off, just like that. So this light needs to be polished. Uh, you can't exactly see on the camera. It's and I don't know if you can see it. It's a wee bit faded and marked, slightly faded. This one's already been polished. Now you can obviously see it's much cleaner. Got Audi TT for a roof wrap and a splitter. We we'll just removed the old vinyl. You can see slightly yellow this side comparing to that one. There could be a vinyl glue. Again, we don't know what vinyl was applied. Could be an eBay. So you just discolored the slightly the color of the roof. Either that or it was already yellow, and that's why it was wrapped in the first place. Uh, it's been wrapped as well. Yeah, so. So again, uh, roof wrapped on this one, and we've got a splitter 
right there to go in the front. It looks like it does need a splitter actually. <laughs> it looks like it does need a splitter. Oh, is that from the car? Yeah, oh, okay. Car. Yeah, yeah. And then this one is for decroming. Yeah. So, front grille, it's gonna be fun. Mirrors, handles, which will need to come off. The back handle, and I think that was it. Um, probably find something else but I think that's most of it so and then we've got another car outside for detailing this one's being collected today and that one is still being done so another busy busy week and I might have a Ford Ranger coming in this week for some EPF and detail as well a big job so oh. It's Thursday. I don't know when I did the last video. <laughs> Just the usual, because it's always mayhem. Kenny's been, he's been doing well today. <laughs> no, nothing wrong with Audi. I love Audis. I drive Audi. Don't buy BMWs. For one bit of plastic. Yeah. So we've got this RS6, a stunning color. It's for a decroming. So again, while well, the bottom pieces are done. The top piece is in progress, there's still the rails to be done. But back diffuser all gonna be fun to we'll see if it comes off. But for the front we had to take the bumper off because all the different shapes on the bumper, like the bottom piece there, so it was what 12 screws? 12 screws just for that. Just for a wheel lip on the bottom of a bumper. And you can't exit without the bumper. The grill obviously you have to take, well normally we do them on a the car, this one's, this big one's, uh, it's on the desk there, but uh, the this one off was Yeah, for the quad shot thing, yeah, so not, but we had the bumper off, so might as well take it off And then, yeah, because of this <coughs> This big quad shot piece here Which also needs to be done We'll have to take the front bumper off And the copper fins those fins need to also be wrapped, so we'll get them done, we'll get the bumper back on. And then here we've got a wee, uh, what is this car? Corsa? Anyway, quickly for in and out for the window, rear window tent. So we've got a parcel this morning. Hey, no, ex not expecting any. <laughs> Don't zoom on my address. Can you work it? Well, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Hey, people wanted honeycomb for their grill, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> so we cheated a bit. <laughs> we pre-read it. Can you read the box already? He spoiled the, the surprise. He spoiled it. What did you read the box? Read the card. <laughs> He's got X-ray vision. <laughs> it's a wooden box. Sweet. We'll put that on a display, whatever that is. <laughs> With all the kamikaze products in there. Wow. Oh. Champagne. Right, see you later, Kenny. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> I'll see you next year. And it's Friday as well. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Yep. It's actually from uh, from Rory. Whee! Roy. Roy? Rory. Rory, yeah. <laughs> Go on, Kenny, get your fuck together. It's early in the morning. Yeah. <laughs> um, it's almost like a Christmas gift, eh? No, it's for the saying thank you for looking after this car, which is the BMW that we've wrapped in orange or possibly orange. there. M4. Yeah. Stunning car. Yeah. And look at that. Two bottles. So which one will be over. back in next year? It's got a new bonnet. We're gonna be sold. Yeah, out, uh, next year. It's supposed to be actually done two weeks ago. Two weeks ago, but the body shop is taking a lot of ages to get it painted before we can wrap it. So yeah. So we'll get a wrap next year. Uh, but that's nice, thanks Rory. 
I put a smile on his face this morning. <laughs> it's Friday. Good weekend. <laughs> Starting. It's JR. Not gonna, not gonna last. Not gonna last. JR's got something to compete with now. Yeah, JR. Get those sweetie boxes away, yeah? That's what I'm talking about. You need to pick a big box next time. <laughs> Chocolate boxes, right? We've got Audi needs to finish that off today. This one. Well, I think it's one side to polish and roof and bits and bobs. Yeah. This one, I'm hoping to put some cuttings on it one day, but <laughs> still, still, <laughs> still stealing wheel to do and bits and bobs. And we've gone probably for Renji coming in today for, well, hopefully quite a bit of work. So we'll figure it out once he comes in. <laughs> so Kenny's carry on with this one, need to get it, give it back by end of the week. So it's pretty good. He's a miracle. So he's a miracle. So finishing off polishing then we'll be doing uh I don't even know what coating is on it, but this one's my yeah, Abbey. just my app is it? Yeah, so just my Abbey code on it. This one's still here. How long has it been here? Two weeks now? <laughs> and it's gonna be it's gonna be probably longer. Uh, we'll see. We might be getting coating done this this uh, week if we if we have enough time. We've got a new steering wheel on it. Oh, but look, wrong side of the car. So we've got that installed. The car behind us. It's in for a bit of a work. It's a brand new car. Actually, I'll show you something. For a for a brand new car. Um, it should look a bit better. So they had, uh, I mean, obviously you still got glue from the transport folio that they use, protective film. Uh, there was a dent in here, which has been pulled out now. That mirror has been obviously painted black, and you can see green shade, so it's not been painted very well. Um, so we're tinting the windows just now on it. No, that but I mean, a couple of things, but obviously they were where they removing a protective foil. They missed a bit there, so we need to get that done. We've got another car outside as well, which is project in itself. So I'll have a look outside. I'll go through around that. It's a beetle. A beetle that been dropped off for a full wrap. Well, we saw the paint this morning. Which I've seen better days. Look at this. Now, it's not, the paint underneath is actually silver, which is fine. But this, I don't even know what it is because if you rub it with your finger in some places like here, you can see it's actually coming off. So it's either uh, some spray can, I think it's a plastic dip, but poorly applied plastic dip because you can actually see a pearlescent effect to it. So it's got some sparkle. So unless it's a spoon spray can, but I think it could be a, a plastic dip so someone tried to get something done with it. But look at this thing. So we'll see what we can do with this problem with the plastic dip. You should be really reapplying the plastic dip once a year to keep their coat fresh. Um, and you should at least do three, four coats so it actually saves and comes off. I think this one is can just maybe one coat and that's it. So we need to see if it comes off. If it does, we either leave, maybe do the polishing on it, or we actually do a wrap. Depends what clients wants to do. And then obviously roof needs to come out. Which looks like a, a digital print. And then we've wrapped. I don't actually know what happens here. It doesn't doesn't look like it's got rails, does it? No, it does have rails. So they actually wrapped a, instead of tucking it in underneath the 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 side rail thing, they actually wrapped over it. Ah, oh, poor poor. I mean, even antenna has been sprayed with this sparkly thing. So I think yeah, there's something been going on on this. Let's see what we can do with it, and then well, we'll see if we have enough time because that's a one, two, three, four cars to do in the next two weeks. <coughs> it's 
So we've got progress. Find a solution. Probably not the best one, but it works. Lots of tar and a brush. Luckily the paint's already been scuffed for installing that paint or whatever that was. Uh, Kenny's got his mask on. <laughs> so we're getting uh, basically scrapped off and then with the rubber or polish and we'll see. But one way of doing it. Sean is on the case. If. <laughs> We've got Robbie here, he's on the phone, business as always, eh? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but it's kind of silver there. Yeah, silver. Originally it's silver. Silver scuffed. Alright guys, it's Friday. <laughs> Try that without the mask. Can't hear me. <laughs> so we use the five litres of no, it tar and glue. Five. There it was, half of the other one, half of that, but at least. So it's probably five liters. I've got it off. Well, he did. There. <laughs> so we're gonna give a quick pressure wash. Still got vinyl to come off. And we'll see how clean it becomes. The only thing we did notice when we took it apart was the big deep scratch here. Morning guys, how we doing? It's Tuesday and another week we had yellow Vauxhall it's now gone we went on Saturday yesterday Nissan Skyland went away as well it came out actually really really well in the Sun the pearlescent paint really stand out but this week we are crazy busy what we've got here we've got this Ford Ranger and on this one we had front end uh, paint protection film we still got to do the side bumpers top of the roof and bits and bobs this one big transformation you probably remember this one from the other video where they had a funny paint on top so now it's all been stripped it's getting machine polished um, this slide was actually polished because you look totally different than that one I don't know if I've got a video before it's just been on quickly we've got Sean helping us as well it's just been so crazy busy well, we've got this Audi A3 for uh, enhancement so that needs a machine polish ceramic coating and we've got this Morgan here for uh, machine polish and ceramic coating as well really nice the wheels are so cool so we've got this one to go out probably as soon as possible this one out by Friday this one out well should be Friday but it's gonna be probably a bit longer because the wheels are getting powder coated on that one as well plus those wheels are getting powder coated as well those wheels needs to be coated and whole car needs to be coated it's pretty much almost finished polishing so this one needs to be out by Friday as well so yeah this week has been it's been mayhem I'll try to grab my camera as much as possible but I'm concentrating more on the future videos which you can watch um, either past or after this video right um, we got some breakfast cup of tea and we'll crack on with this finish this PPF on that one and as always don't forget to subscribe like the video and smash that hit notification notification bell there
day. You've just been lying on the floor. Yes, I have. <laughs> and look what happened. More what? <laughs> no, I didn't. I don't pee, pee myself, no. <laughs> right. Say where that's from. What age? <laughs> right, PPF done on the Ford Ranger. Still need a way to dry it out and... Oh, don't. Yeah, well, still got mirrors to do, but this one is getting painted, so we'll have to wait for this to come back. Not but I need to... Us. Need to... St no, not because of us, no. Still needs to get a... Wait for it to dry and... Finish the edges. Um, These wheels come on. Wheels, yeah, last wheel to go back on. Just be just been coated. So that's going back on. And we'll give a good clean ceramic coating to go on that one tomorrow. This one's pretty much finished. Roof has been wrapped. A couple stripes there and here. Wheels are getting powder coated. That's going back on tomorrow. Same on those ones. Wheels going back tomorrow. Is he getting calipers painted on the Audi? So yeah, just enhancement paint on this one. Enhancement, yep. Kenny's just taking the badges off, he's going in a gloss black. Uh, still do be. That's only eight months polish. Yeah, this paint has been really bad on that car, so that's definitely an improvement. And what's this? The other one is not even touched yet, so sorry. <laughs> we'll, get, we'll get to it. Um, yeah, those three cars need to pretty much be out by Friday, and then we can crack on with this one. They will need to be done by Friday. Yeah, well. That will be done by Friday. I'll be on that one tomorrow polishing. Ke no, tomorrow we'll do in coatings. Kenny will be no, doing. No, we're doing coatings. Coating will be. Kenny will be doing over time on that one. No, no. So. We'll be doing coatings, coating, weight coat, coating, and then coating on that one while I finish polishing. Why do I always get the good jobs, eh? So, you, we do all the other it's jobs. okay, I'll get Sean to do it. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're gonna tidy up, get out my way. over the floor. Oh, <laughs> and I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning, noisy. So, Beetle is pretty much ready as much as it can be. We work to the budget, um, and obviously, the state of it was something a client is waiting in a waiting room. And as you can see, a big transformation. So we've added some side stripes, some back stripes, wheels were powder coated, the rear diffuser was wrapped as well, roof was wrapped as well. Um, new but new caps on the on the wheels as well. There was a big scratch on that side of the door, so we put the stripes through it so it kinda hides it a little bit away, takes a takes eye off it. The tint was really bad, so we just removed the tint to tidy it all up. Um, there's a still paint in places, but it's, you would have to take panels off to really get good access to everything else. So two stripes in the middle, the badges were wrapped as well to make a bit difference. So we did silver and, and gloss black because they were all peeled off. The front, front piece was uh, painted in gloss black. The same in the mirrors were painted in gloss black. Just making make it a car really looking pretty much brand new. So a big, big transformation. I'll post the picture probably in the corner somewhere on this video if I remember to so you can see the what it was before. I, I don't know if I've got a video before or not. Yeah, it's got bash and bangs and scratches and scrapes, but it's you know it's quite old car. <laughs> the, the transformation is massive. Yeah, yeah. It's like therapy. <laughs> <laughs> 
But we've got here, we've got Kenny, we've got Sean, we've got he's, Ford he's Ranger. Yeah. You just so, Sean sometimes, yeah. <laughs> you just Ford Ranger's finished. This one is like 99% finished. This one is 99.9% .9 finished. <laughs> 999. Right, so clients come in in about an hour to pick this one up. And when you do the feature video. So we did roof wrap was tile wrapped a while ago, windows we did a while ago. So now we had the enhancement. Powder got the wheels. It has to redo it all again. I don't care. But front badge, Audi badge was uh, replaced with the gloss black and the same with the back badge. So, all, right, all good. And this one, single stage machine polish, two coats of my Abbey. Wheels are pretty interesting. To get them, get them on nice, but they're all coated. Monday it's cold, December, almost Christmas. We've got this Vogue rather nice color on that. How to Vogue Biography Edition. Nice kind of gray. So single stage machine polish and this one it doesn't actually get ceramic coating. This one will have a overcoat still from Kamikaze collection. We'll give it three to six months protection and it will still bring the gloss and depth of the color. It's basically a seal with a infused ceramic coating. We normally use that for uh, maintenance protection and kind of thing. Um, so I just did a one pass in here, which you can see is a bit better. And you can still see the soils here. And that's after a single pass. So we'll get that, we'll get that car done. Go another one here, brand new X3M. Kenny says he doesn't feel cold, so he's washing that. <laughs> Either he doesn't feel cold or he doesn't have feeling at all anymore. What's that? Yeah. <laughs> so we had a nice ice skating going on this morning here a wee bit, but it's it's warmed up. It's about seven degrees now. So so we've got this brand new X3. And that's for a single stage. Pretty much new car preparation, but we'll be finished off with that. Um, and recoating our top of the range coating five years um, probably protect the leathers inside interior as well wheels in and out so go to the car here for about two weeks now well we'll have it for two weeks so you'll be picked up just before the new year uh, so we'll get that done morning morning Kenny yeah, yeah. Friday, he doesn't talk on Friday. <laughs> uh, last car before Christmas and New Year. BMW, we had uh, Evoke this week, which is already gone. And this one is for a new car preparation detail. So it was a single stage. I was just refining the paintwork because it was pretty good. And all the paint was protected with the. Sorry? There is a new car. <laughs> and the old paint was protected with um, and recoating. We'd given up to five years protection. Well, really looks really good. Wheels were coated with G on rim, in and out, the same with the brake calipers. And those mirrors are actually very interesting. They had a lot of stains on them. Um, which we managed to take it off with a bit of a polish, it was really fine. But when you do anything to those mirrors, wipe them with alcohol or polish or anything, they give a really strange smell. Um, if anyone knows what BMW uses to paint those mirrors, 
please put down in the comments below. But it's it's almost like a burning smell on those on those mirrors. But it's all clean now. It's all protected, and it's the same with the with the front grill. So I just need to do a feature video, and that's it. That's us. So good. It's a really nice car. Oh, oh look at the clocks. So, do the last video, and then we'll be closing down for Christmas New Year. Well, the only thing I can say: remember, subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, hit the notification bell, and all the best. Merry Christmas. Where's Kenny? Kenny, say Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, and a Happy New Year. And I'll see you in 2019. Hope it's gonna be even a better year.